Okay, today we are doing uh, dish cloth. You can also use these as uh, washcloths. Um, just depends on your preference. They work good for both. And this is just a single crochet. Um, we will be starting out with 30. You will need a crochet hook size H. Uh, scissors and a tapestry needle for this project. Oh, all kinds of strange things lying around. If you hear any noise on this video, it's because my two dogs are under my desk. So, just so you know. And one's a puppy, so she's kind of playing with the older one. So, anyhow, and this will be okay. You need to do. 31 so we're going to chain 31 and you do this with cotton it's better it works better um, than your waste yarn um, cotton's your best for this uh, I think I got peaches and cream here or something like that I don't even know anyway now if I can get this stuff to cooperate with me haha <laughs> Alrighty, alrighty, okay, make sure I'm doing it in front of the thing there. Okay, so we're going to chain 31. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. And this hooks uh, a G, so it's going to be a little bit smaller than, but normally I use an H and I just couldn't find my H at the moment. So this will have to do for now. All right, okay. Now we want to do uh, 30 single crochets. I do these to, according to my own pattern. Um, the books usually ask to make the patterns bigger. I don't like my wash cloths or wa um, wash rag, or uh, dish towel, dish cloths to be bigger than this because they don't fit in the cups when you wash the cups. That is the reason why mine is smaller than the pattern in the books. Because uh, the ones in the books are just huge. <laughs> okay, let's single crochet. And this one's all done single crochet. I will do other patterns that I do for washcloths very soon. Yes, and I will have uh, the blog up where where the pattern to this is. So, no worries. Um, and this is just a big spool of cotton. You could buy the smaller ones. Um, the smaller ones work just as good the little smaller ones. I just have a big one here because I actually make a lot of these. Um, like I said, if you haven't heard before, I want to do the farmer's market this year in my town. So far the application hasn't been up, put up yet, so I can't sign up for it, but I'd like to. Um, just waiting it patiently out. I even sent them a note and they didn't get back to me and that's kind of kind of depressing but that's okay okay I know I should have a lot of this stuff up on my FC but I think I think I'm gonna um, just do 
on the one Etsy shop I have right now, I'm thinking about just doing pet stuff. Because pet <coughs> stuff seems to be selling better. I'm apologizing. My dog is now, my puppy is now playing with my cat. <laughs> uh, yeah. Alrighty. And uh, this pattern is 36 rows long, just so you know, this is 36 rows. So, so it's going to be 30 in each row by 36 rows. Fun. And like I said, I'll have this pattern up on my blog. And the blog will be put in the down box. Like always. And um, I didn't trim around this one. Um, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Um, I think I'm going to leave this one the way it is and not put trim around it. Um, we'll do a non-trim one. <laughs> um, often I put trim around them. Um, it just makes the product look a little bit better. You don't have to. And my drawer's coming open here. <laughs> Uh, and yes, this is my craft room, um, slash bedroom, but I don't have half the stuff that I want set up yet, so I don't really give people a tour of it, because it's just this desk and one other container at the moment. I actually keep most of my yarn in the closet, in bags and boxes. <laughs> I want to get some containers plastic containers for them. I just haven't gotten that far. Oh, and a bookshelf where I keep all all my books, which is, well, let's just say I need another bookshelf. It's like overcrowded. I just throw all my books on there. And I kind of, well, I don't only crochet. Um, So I kind of do a lot of different kinds of crafts. Uh, I kind of dabble in a lot of stuff. <laughs> Believe it or not. Alrighty. Um, you can count and make sure there's 30 um, single crochet in every roll if you like. I've just been doing this stuff for so long that I... Most of these patterns I know by heart. They're like in my head. So that's the reason why I can just sit down and go to it. I'm weird like that. Alright, and then you make sure there's 30 in each row. And then chain one and go to the next one. If you hear voices, one of my sons is home. He's not feeling that good. He's got the sniffles. So. My youngest son is home, I should say. <laughs> I actually have four children, so. But only three of them live with me. My oldest lives on his own, so. Like I said, the cat is torturing my dog. <laughs> At least I think. Maybe it's the other way around. I don't know. <laughs> Crazy animals. I don't know if I'm going to get this all done in this video. I might, and I might not. Um, I don't crochet as fast as some people do. I'm, even though I crochet every day, 
well, almost every day. Some days I don't. I do take breaks from this stuff. Because I do have other stuff to do. throw already. My cat's definitely torturing my puppy. <laughs> you think the puppy would get it already? <laughs> apologize for my pets <laughs> whoa come on guys hopefully you can still see sorry <laughs> like I said I have pets in the house <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to wonder if I shouldn't buy a crate and like put the puppy in the crate when I'm doing these <laughs> just so she stays out of trouble <laughs> I am hoping you guys can still see this <laughs> <laughs> we may end up cutting this video kind of short <laughs> anywho <laughs> oh yeah again I apologize Of course you do know that the cat would probably torture the dog while the dog's in the kennel. <laughs> uh, my sister's uh, cats were known for doing that to my other dog when I used to kennel her when I used to leave the house. The cat would torture the dog. We actually caught it on film because we were wondering why the dog was making such a ruckus all the time and we caught one of the cats torturing the dog. <laughs> oh yeah. Alrighty. Actually, I'm I'm making cat toys right now. I'm I'm uh doing for my Etsy shop. I'm trying to drum up some business on it cuz I really kind of need to pay bills. This is what I do for a living. I have a, one of my sons has a muscle dystrophy and when I was working he was getting worse instead of better and then uh, the person I was living with uh, moved out on me and um, I have a hard time finding someone that will take my son off the bus so I ended up staying home yeah I'm thinking about starting some other shops on Etsy focusing on one thing here and there I guess 
like I said, I, I crochet a lot. I do a lot of a lot of stuff. I actually like this. It's more calming than of course according to the state I'm supposed to work alone, so <laughs> Yet they won't give me my disability, go figure. I'm not exactly a person that works nights. <laughs> I'm a day person. I tried to explain that to them, but it fell on deaf ears. Because after 9 o'clock, I'm pretty much, pretty much shot. After 9 p.m., uh, I'm pretty much done. And a lot of jobs run until like midnight. <laughs> second shift and I'm like where am I supposed to find a job that I work by myself other than being a janitor one of the places I worked at I was actually told that they will not hire me because I have bipolar and then when I said she can't do that she goes well if you tell anybody I'll deny it I hate it when they use that card. That's like the last person I was living with. They blamed me kicking them out on my bipolar. And it's like, uh, no girl wants to be shot with, a, with an airsoft gun. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, that has nothing to do with bipolar. And I couldn't even talk in public, because if I talked in public, I was embarrassing him, so... <sighs> that got kind of annoying. And if I can't be me, uh, that's too bad. You can see if I was throwing a fit in public, but I was not. I may be loud at times, but but whatever. I'd rather be be alone, keep my animals and my kids. They're better. Kids are better behaved. <laughs> Sad, isn't it? Keep ki keep my kids and my animals. Well, I'm gonna be going into gardening pretty soon, so. And I found out the small town I live in no longer sells catnip anywhere. That's kind of frustrating. Especially when you make cat toys for a living. That's kind of frustrating. So it looks like I'm going to end up growing my own... My own uh, catnip and stuff. Oh, come on. All day. What do we got here? Okay. Let's solve that problem. Okay, hopefully we won't have any more mishaps on here. And again, at the end of this row, count to make sure you have 30 in the row, because that's what you want for this particular pattern. And don't forget to chain one and turn at the end of every row, because that helps. Unless you're at the end of your... You know what I mean. Anywho... And we're doing single, single crochet. And this is what it'll look like when you're done. Hopefully, anyway. Hopefully, I'm still in picture here. Goofy pets. Um, like I said, make sure you're using cotton, and these work great for for your dishes and for you. I don't suggest you use the same one for you and your dishes, but 
to each his own. You know, have separate ones for whatever. And my pets are finally settling down. Hopefully. <laughs> Yeah, cotton works best for for these. And I'll say it again, you're going to want 36 rows. Actually, I like this color. I like the color blue. It's lovely nice. I hope you guys are enjoying these tutorials. At least I hope so. Anyway. Don't forget to hit like and share. And leave comments and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate that. And I like hearing from you guys. No matter what it is. Like I said, if you hear a lot of racket, it's it's my pets being sassy. They just seem to not want to cooperate with me today. So if the camera gets bumped or jarred, you know why. <laughs> I have my uh, camera on a tripod beside me. So... No switches. <laughs> do, 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 do. And my puppy runs between the desk and through the tripod. <laughs> I'm going to have to like put something up there to block that. So she can't do that. And now she is wrestling with my other dog. So after this row, I'm going to call it quits. <laughs> <laughs> for today but you know that this will be finished so and yes I'm going to I'm thinking about putting up a site for these eventually and the pattern will be up on my on my uh, up on my on my blog I am now considering tying my dog up <laughs> when I do these. She's a young pup. She's about, uh, about 14 weeks old, I think. Don't even know. Isn't that terrible? Hey, you. Alrighty. Thanks for watching, and like I said, I'll have the pattern up on uh, on my uh, on my blog. So, thanks for watching this video. Um, like I said, please hit like, share, subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to leave a comment if you like. Um, well, talk to you sometime soon. Bye bye.